Hi, my name is Jaleesa Jaikaran. I'm a makeup artist and today I am recreating one of the looks from Fashion Week. I'm always inspired by the Chromat show. They always push the boundaries when it comes to fashion and I love how that intertwines with beauty. I'm from Trinidad and I love a lot of color so I love the looks that Chromat does. This season they did a really bright blue lip and I love to wear blue so I'm going to be doing a matte blue lip today and then adding a pop of color on top of it so I'm going to show you how to get this look. At first you want to start with Lip Scrumptious and I love to use this because if I'm doing a bold lip I really want my lips to be moisturized and this is just going to take off any dead skin and make sure that the, the lipstick glides on really smoothly. Ugh, it smells so good. Sometimes I like to let it sit for like a minute or two and then I take a wipe and I like to put my finger in it and remove all the excess. And doing it this way gives me a little bit more control as opposed to just doing like that. Even after this, I like to use a little bit of lip conditioner because I really want the color to last. So I'm going to give myself a little bit more moisture. Next, I'm going to take a concealer and I like to use a deeper concealer because around my mouth has some darkness. It's going to help me color correct um, and make sure that my skin looks perfect because the lip is the focus and I want my skin to be perfected. So I'm taking a bit of NW45 and NW51 and I'm going to apply this around my mouth. And I always like to mix colors because I feel like it just balances perfectly. Then I'm going to take a 224 brush and blend. Now that around my mouth is perfected, now we can move on to the lipstick. We have the lip conditioner sitting, so now we're just going to take a little tissue and blot the excess moisture. So I'm going to go in with Matte Royale and this is a really rich blue color. And I like to keep the skin simple and let the lipstick be the star. Using the pointy tip of the lipstick, I'm going to go to the corner of the lips and that's where we're going to start. I always like to use my lipstick as a lip liner as well because the bullet is a perfect shape to get, you know, a nice clean line. And then you can fill in the rest of the lip with the flat part of the lipstick. Now you don't have to do this, but I always like to add a bit of black to my blue lipsticks. I'm going to be using a liquid lipstick in Caviar. And I'm just going to take the tip of the brush and apply it on the corners and lightly press in. Now this is a liquid lipstick, so it is going to dry really fast. I'm just going to go over with the blue lipstick and make sure it looks super blended. This just gives it a bit of an ombre effect without being too much. We are not done. I'm going to be applying Grand Illusion Liquid Lip Color in Luna Module. And I love this color because it has like flecks of purple and blue. And it's just going to be the perfect finish to this lip. And I'm only applying this to the center of the lip because I don't want it to bleed. And throughout the day, it's going to travel a little bit. So just apply it to the center and you're done. So I feel like wearing this blue, like a darker blue, as opposed to like the chromat bright blue is a little bit more wearable. This color kind of reminds me of like an aubergine, like purples, like colors that I already wear. And you know, if I had to try any unconventional color, it would be something like this because my skin is pretty natural. I like my, you know, my highlight to be popping and my brows to be, you know, snatched, but I, can live with this lip because it's just fun and it's something that I would definitely try again. Stay tuned to see more Fashion Week inspired looks.